Protesters gathered at the border of El Paso, Texas and Juarez, Mexico today to express their outrage. Since 1993, murder has claimed the lives of over 300 women. Scores of other women are missing, their fates unknown. Over and over, without end, girls go missing and other girls are found. Murdered, raped, mutilated, dumped. Bodies discarded in the high desert like refuse. Step across the border and the laws that govern us no longer apply. It is time that the companies that profit from these conditions are held to account for perpetuating them. Still, every day and night, more young women brave the killing fields. Decals designate houses to which they can flee for safety. But this is cold comfort to the woman alone on an empty stretch of road between her bus stop and the shanty town in which she resides. Lesson number five. Repeat after me. Where is the post office? Where is the post hey. office? peligroso. Tienes que tener muchísimo cuidado. ¿Necesitas un lugar para quedarte? ¿Ah? ¿Ah? Mira, si yo te puedo ayudar. ¿Ah? ¿Quieres que te ayude? ¿Ah? Porque tengo un amigo y él tiene un lugar. Sabe conseguir trabajo. ¿Ah? ¿Quieres? Son gente buena. Voy a caminar contigo. Vamos. ¿Ok? I'm Karina Danes, This Week LA. Uh, Professor Chabot gave me your name in Los Angeles, said you might be able to help me out with some sources and give me your own perspective on the killings of the women down here. We have an appointment with a police official. Can we talk later? Well, maybe I could sit in on it with you. No, no, no. This isn't a press conference, Miss Danes. We are talking to the police to improve the identification of the victims and notification of their relatives, I'll okay? I'll be quiet as a mouse. 
promise. Well, I don't see the harm. Then how do you respond to the allegations that the police are involved in the mass cover-up? We have made several arrests to police officers, as I'm sure you know. Any further mention of conspiracies ignores the realities of the strike we have taken. But from the public perspective, 300 women are dead and nothing is being done. Would you care to comment on that? We are a small police force faced with a massive task. I can assure you that every lead, every clue, it's followed and investigated thoroughly to the utmost. Perhaps not as quickly as we would like, but there is a tremendous backlog. We are not the FBI. How come more people aren't being charged? How come you don't have more suspects? Let's put this in perspective. There are more murders in New York and in L.A. in one month than occur here in a whole year. As for police corruption there and here, it represents a small, albeit disgraceful element. Esto es una falta de respeto. You know, those women are still dead. They don't have a spokesperson. Maybe you could join us on our next meeting, Miss Staines. You're inviting her? So sorry to keep you waiting. Father, how are you? Good to see you again. Sorry, Mr. Patroni, you don't have to shake my hand. I'm sorry, uh, do I know you? No, but I know you. You're a flat for the factory owners, right? Well, I'm the uh, PR representative for a consortium of U.S. factories here, yes. You? Karina Danes. I work for This Week LA. Ah, the West Side Workers' Group. So what's the spin you're putting on the abductions and the murders of the factory workers down here in Juarez? Well, it's hardly spin, Ms. Uh, Danes. The issue is safety. You have no idea how it works down here. Oh, enlighten me. Well, we have living quarters for most of the girls, the workers. We, we shepherd them to them from the factories on company buses. You should see it. Oh, I'd like to. That's why I came down here. You want to show me? Well, I, I'm afraid I'm leaving for L.A. shortly, so I... Uh, of course. What? El Paso is one of the safest cities in America, but right here, where we are standing, you take your own life in your hands just because you are outside when the sun goes down. If you built your factories in America, you have to pay attention to the uh, laws and the regulations for workplace safety, for minimum wage, working conditions. Here, you can do what you want. Why don't you come off it, all right? People come down here to benefit from the economy. They're not victims. They come for and they find a better life. Okay. Good afternoon, Father. Ayúdame a doblar las cajitas, ¿no? Voy a hacer buen dinero. Aparte, a lo mejor de ahí me puedo cruzar la frontera. Que de algo sirvan todas las clases de inglés que he tomado. Y voy a seguir practicando. Uh, Miss Danes, later on this evening I'll be visiting with one of the mothers of the victims. You're welcome to join me. I'm sure you'll be the soul of discretion. Thank you, Father. Learn the future tense. Estoy tan preocupada, mi amorcito. Una ciudad con tantos peligros. Mamá, no quiero que te preocupes. No. Sí. No, no más, mamá. Si no, no me voy, ¿eh? Por favor, por favor, mamá. Ten fe, la madre virgen. Y que María te, te guíe. Mira, tengo algo para ti. Mi abuelita. Ay, no. Para que te proteja. Pero este es tuyo, mamá. No, es tuyo. Me encanta este medallón. Lo amo. Gracias, mamá.
Su nombre era Luz. ¿Usted habla español? Poco. Her name was Luz. I'm going to speak in American uh, English. We do not even know if she made it to the factory for the late shift, or maybe she was turned away. Usted sabe si, um, even if they're late, one minute, they're turned away. Eh, and luego, eh, they have to make the whole trip back eh, en la noche, eh, en night, alone. We, we told the police she's missing. She never stays away. They ask, does she have a boyfriend? Is she out dancing every night? Ella trabaja. She, she, she works every night. They ask, does she wear um, revealing outfits? Desgraciados. They ask disgusting questions. In this place, they dare to ask these disgusting questions. Ándale, pues, tú ya estás demasiado madurita. Lucia didn't even tell me that they had found her body. My vecina, she heard it on the television. <sighs> Mijita. They dump her body. Violado. <laughs> Did you hear it? Yeah, what was it? ¿Qué pasa? No puede pasar. ¿Ah? Who gave the padre a free pass? Who do you think? Padre. Jorge Herrera. Váyase. Gabriel Lauro. A sus órdenes. Nunca nos hemos conocido. Soy nuevo aquí. Soy parte de la investigación de homicidios. Excelente. Bueno, ¿qué traemos? ¿Qué tenemos aquí? Yo nunca he visto un... Pues no hay ni un cuerpo, padre. Pero esperamos que se encuentre por aquí. Se desangró. 
¿Y ellos? ¿Son...? Sospechosos. No. Solo son campesinos. Estaban caminando la parada del autobús. Llamaron cuando vieron el mole. ¿Llamaron de dónde? Del celular del joven. ¿A usted cree? No tiene para zapatos, pero no sale sin celular. ¿Ya qué? ¿Y qué tenemos fiesta o qué? No sé quién es. Hey, ¿Qué pito tocas? ¿Qué onda? Hey, I'm a reporter. I'm with the him. Sorry. Sorry, no reporteros. No reporteros. Well, I just got a sign. Has there been another killing? We don't know that yet. Well, what do you have? You have something? This is official police business. You take one more step, and I'll have to arrest you. You know that bullshit they say about Mexican jails? It's not bullshit. Que no pase. Está bien. Padre. What do they have? Blood everywhere. Hey, what are you saying? Huh? You okay? Chihuahua, Mexico, somewhere south of Juarez. It's a place called La Mas de Palaya. I think I couldn't. good apparently. You're a real lone wolf, eh? Some of my other customers like to entertain in a group, you know? Like to pass the little puta around. No, 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 not me. Yes, yes. This one. She's perfect. Just arrived. No one knows her. Isidro, trajeron a una muchacha. Es una trabajadora de las fábricas. Dicen que la atacaron. No sabes si es Lisbeth. No sé. Filia tu esponja, Fracto. Recordar en misericordia tu e. Efice et ipse quoque agnoscan. Ali cuando quem nisi histi drum. Dominum Jesum Christum. Liberati sumus qui si gloria infinita, nomine Padre, Filio e Spirito Santo.
Detective Lauro. Hijo de chingada madre. Detective Lauro. Do you think that this is going to help? Do you think that this 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 fixation is going to do any good? Fixation? Are you kidding? The decent citizens of Juarez are being scared away. And for the criminals, it's, it's an open invitation. Everywhere, everywhere, these, these reminders. It's not just a memorial, Detective. It's a warning. You know they're going to keep coming down here for work, and they're going to keep on getting killed. Because there's no one to protect them. help me. Please, somebody help me. You're an American. You tell them somebody took my Lisbeth. I don't know. I keep coming back and asking and asking, and nobody can tell me. She didn't come home Wednesday evening. <laughs> and I keep coming back, and they say they know nothing. Nothing! Is this your wife? This is a small force. We're sometimes slow to identify. It's a bureaucratic problem. There's no malice involved. There's only so much we can do. But we have a lead. A young factory worker was brought in last night. She survived an attack. Someone survived? Well, who is she? Three men found her walking in the desert. What well, could they be the ones? No, no, no. The shift just ended. They brought her in. She. She's at the hospital where I work. You, you know her name? No. She hasn't talked since she arrived. Well, so you haven't interviewed her? Not yet. The doctor says she's still in shock. done this thing. This must end. Yes, it must. Miss Daines, you should leave now. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. One second. <clears throat> at home? No, no, no. My Elizabeth is gone. her my business card. Yes, a card with my name and my phone number on it. Yes, I didn't find it among her things. Listen, pendejo, I am worrying that it is going to turn up. What? You 
can be sure of that? Ella está viva. Sí. Mariela, qué bonito. Pues dime, Mariela, ¿de dónde eres? Tu familia debe estar muy preocupada por ti. Has aguantado mucho. Es la verdad. La vi. Tiene que creer. bus driver that dropped off Lisa Bed was the last person to see her alive. The police interviewed him, but they don't have enough evidence. Poor Isidro. You believe in stigmata? It's acknowledged by the church. Isidro feels he witnessed a miracle. What do you think about that? I think it is a miracle that she survived the attack. Uh -huh. So I've been doing some research on you. Got your hands pretty full in East L.A. Well, many of the folks in our congregation have relatives in Juarez, and they're getting pretty worried. What a family you have, you and your brother. It's a pretty serious gang he's running there. Are you here to exploit the situation between my brother and I? It's a pretty wild dichotomy. You, the man of God, and your brother, the gangbanger, right? Well, both God and the devil have my brother by the tail, Miss Danes. But he tries to be a Christian in his own way. Is that it? Is this just a good story? No. That's not the reason. And what is the reason? Why would an attractive woman like yourself come to Juarez on her own and place herself in harm's way if not for glory? It's not for glory. I've been there, Father. I've done that. Oh? I wrote a piece on Chinese women that were being imported to work in the sex industry. I had the source inform me of the ship's container that was full of people, young women, actually. I knew where it was, and I knew how long it had been there, but I didn't tell the police right away. I wanted to get a crew together and time the arrival of the cops on the dock with the six o'clock news, because you know, that was, uh, that was my plan. But it didn't work out, you know. Cops were late, and the news was over, and when they opened the door of the container, there were just 36 dead girls. No one blamed me. 
no one blamed me because it was a good story and I was a, I broke the story. But there was this one girl who looked at me and she was looking straight at me and she blinked and then she died. And you know what I was doing? I was taking a picture. I mean, all those weeks in a container. And when they finally open the fucking door, you see yourself in a camera lens dying. And I did that. I did that. God forgives. No. I don't believe like you do, Father. He'll forgive you anyway. Yeah. ¿Qué es eso? Hidromorfona y aloperidol. El doctor Guiñán dice que está alucinando. Ella no está alucinando. Ese doctor no es un creyente. Esas drogas son veneno. Can I help you? She was released. Uh, I'm sorry? The girl who was here, what, what happened to her? Uh, I... Help me! Help me! Help me! Please! Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. 
the girl who was attacked? No, that was someone else. She has not been attacked. She has not been touched. That's her. You were there. I was there. This, this is her. What is she doing here? She should be in the hospital and she needs to talk to the police. No, the mothers of the lost ones, they will care for her. She's safe here. Safe? You don't worry about her. I am worried. You see this? See that? You see this? You see these men? They're accused of brutalizing and raping and killing women. You recognize any of them? Miss Danes. Father Herrera. Please. Isidro, will you show these around to the women here? I see if they recognize someone. She should be in the hospital. Are you aware that you're an accomplice to an abduction of a young girl? It's a bit melodramatic. She checked herself out. What is going on here? Mariela, la Virgen, is becoming a symbol for change. A counterpoint to the murders, a miracle. Because of the supposed stigmata? She needs to talk to the police. She has no memory beyond her vision. Besides, the police have their hands full, and they're not all trustworthy. <laughs> We can join La Virgen with other organizations that are calling for change. La Virgen? What are you talking about? <laughs> Does the church condone this? This is the church. as many people as I can. There's so much darkness now, so much fear, and yet she, this young girl, bravely walks into the desert, alone. And what does she see? But our son, Damadi. I want to ask you, why did she walk into the desert? She was pulled. That's all she says. Something was pulling her. Oh. Of course, you cannot understand. You're like everyone. You have lost touch with God. Buenas noches, señorita. Isidro, what happened in the desert? She was covered with a glow, a beautiful, bright, shining light. And when she looked at her hands, she saw that the sangre, the blood, 
was flowing from her, but there was no pain. And then she spoke. She? La Virgen, La Virgen Maria. Maria. She said there was much for her to do. And when next she came to her, she would tell her more. More about what her mission is to be. Mission. She is going to help us. Agarren ese cabrón. There's so many. Why was she handing them out? I don't know to warn people. This will bring them here. They will kill her. She should leave Juarez. Are you becoming a believer, Miss Daines? I just don't want to see her killed. Of course not. But you should get her out of here soon. Mariela. Where's your family? You can't stay here, it's not safe. Can you go home? I have no home. If you stay here, they'll kill you. You understand? His will be done. You have a choice. You know, you do, you have a choice. You have to leave here. We can help you, Father Herrera, I'll help you. We'll make a plan, okay? I have an interview with Mariela. Who? A girl who survived the attack. She has a name. Her name is Mariela. Well, I'd like to talk to Mariela, but she checked herself out of the hospital, and nobody knows where she is or where she came from. I know where she is. I saw her last night. She's become a kind of religious icon. These are devout people, and they are survivors. It's only natural that they revere one of their own. Why don't you let me take you to see her? Later. What? Later? Apart from an all-out drug war raging in Juarez, an American couple has reported their 13-year-old daughter missing. Well, you think it stops because you are here? Every day. Every day we get new advice. Suggestions, training. And tomorrow, there will be another reportera, another priest, another FBI person telling us how incompetent we are, how corrupt and lazy we are. There was a time in Juarez when there were just a few men with knives selling alcohol, tobacco, hookers. But now, now it's hundreds of millions of dollars in drug and human trade, machine guns airplanes, and the drugs everybody up, but the American dollar keeps pouring in. So if there wasn't a demand for cheap Mexican labor and drugs, maybe Juarez would not be a playground for killers. Supply and demand. So if you'll excuse me, I'd like to devote some time to a girl who is missing and most likely murdered. And white. American. American. Debe ser bueno. ¿Qué es lo que quieres? Necesito fumar. ¿Me llamas por eso? Ni que fuera vendedor en la calle. Tienes que estar jugando. ¿Qué te pasa, muchacho? ¿Qué 
¿Quién carajo eres tú? Lárgate. Bendita sea la Virgen. Amén. ¡Lárgate! ¿Qué hay, pues, Maximino? No, pues nada, nomás tenemos una tumba por ahí con una cruz, una tarjeta, solamente. Hijo su. ¿eh? Félix Sabas. ¿Lo conoces? ¿Qué es eso? Ahí voy a la tumba. ¡Escarben! 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 ¡Ayúdenle! Bueno. Hola, Félix. ¿Quién habla? Hey, I want to talk to Félix Sabas. Well, he's not available right now. Ah. Where can I reach him? Try hell. ¿Quién era? ¿Qué le pasó a la muchacha? Pendejo. ¿De qué muchacha estás hablando? De la Virgen. Ah. Eso es una leyenda. Igualita a la del chupacabras. ¿Se lo chingó la chupacabras? ¿O oh, no? Ese cabrón era el chupasangre. ¿Qué planeas hacer? Regresarme a la noche. Debería echarte a la cárcel. Protegerte de ti mismo. Eso no va a cambiar nada. Calmado, viejito. Cuidado. sweatshops under appalling conditions and then they have to make their way home by the grace of God without getting raped and killed. We did a story on the Juarez murders, front page. Look, if we do a hundred stories and nothing changes, we should do a hundred more. We're not the Juarez Weekly. Last week there was a bust in the valley. It was a brothel and it was full of young girls from Juarez. You know, Jack the Ripper killed five women a hundred years ago and people are still talking about it. Now hundreds of women are being murdered on our doorstep, and no one gives a shit. Tijuana's on our doorstep, not Juarez. Oh, I'm sorry. Should we wait until hundreds of girls are getting murdered there? The answer is still no.
Karina. Father, what's going on? What do you mean? The Viva la Virgin, the Corazon Sangra. Yes. 1478. What, what's 1478? What the hell is that? An address, a bank card number, the start of the Spanish Inquisition. Is it? Authorized by Pope Sixtus IV in the year of our Lord, 1478. I need to see her. You can listen to her. 1478 is also a radio frequency. Wait, what? She's on the radio? I, I don't understand. She's supposed to be a long way away from here right now. She is safe. The broadcasts are harmless. She's gathering quite a flock. I think she can help make a difference. What are you up to? Nothing. I've had very little contact with, the, with Maria. She's in the care of my brother, Gio. Uh, I can help arrange a meeting. Wait. OK, 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 arrange a meeting. Ya llegó la gringa. Hi. Are you Gio? Yeah, why? I'm Karina. Your brother sent me. Father, brother? Can I see her? Her who? Mariela. Who? Look, I can help. Yeah, of course you can, huh? And we read your piece. And you know what? Your work needs work. Why don't you go stand in line with everybody else? Gio, please, can you ask her? She's not here. Wait, wait! I'm not kidding no more, right? I'm done with you. Well, just tell her. Tell her wherever she is, I need to talk to her and I'll wait. says Benito para Milagro. What? Come for the miracle. Come for the miracle. Eh? He venido a ver milagro.
que decir? Por favor. Gone down. Bring her. All right, come on, let's go. Yeah. ¿Cómo está usted? ¿Bien? ¿Bien? ¿Y tú? Great. Great. I... I don't understand. I do not understand. You have to tell me what's going on. Because I helped get you out of Juarez somewhere safe. And now you're here with these people. And you're on some kind of crusade. What do you want? Why are you here? Because I only ever wrote about you. I don't know anything. I want you to tell me. You remember anything from before you went to the desert? I just remember how I came out of it. And now you're here in this place with, with these gangsters. These are not gangsters. Well, what are they? To me, they are warriors engaged in a daily battle for survival. These are good men. What happens now? Where does this go? I mean to call attention for the women, uh, for the victims of violence in Juarez, and for the women all around the world. And I want to save them. This was the task that the Holy Mother gave to me, and I'm willing to take it all the way until the day that I die. No, pay attention, Eve. This is Los Angeles. I want the story, Karina. Well, so do a lot of people. Karina! I own the copyright, so I'll happily discuss the English language syndication with you. As long as I get full copy approval. Escuchen me, por favor. El momento ha llegado. El momento del cambio en el que vamos a deshacernos de nuestros opresores, de los que abusan de nosotros. 
expulsemos el mal en todas sus formas. El momento es ahora. es ahora de enfocar a los que abusan a los que reprimen deshagámonos del mal en la faz de nuestras ciudades. Es Eduardo Morales. Y hay gente. Se agrada a la vida. Por favor, pueblo mío. de su chingada madre. Felix Sala? Hello? Do you know what is happening here? Who is it? Detective Laro? That mug sheet that you stole from the office is circulating, you know that? Good. I mean, people should really know who to look out for, don't you think? They are being killed. Who? They are suspects. Do you understand that? Suspects. Some of them are not even that. They're not necessarily guilty of anything. Well, then why do they have mugshots? I know what you did. I know where she is. I don't know what you mean. She is wanted here. For questioning in connection with these murders, the FBI will be informed. Well, well, well. So this is what they mean by strange bedfellows. Miss Daines, you know Patrick Nunzio? Of course. You want to sit down? Would you like to order a drink? Uh, dos cervezas. Por favor. Yes, sir. Right. We're here to ask for your help. Now, all of us agree, I think, that violence does nobody any good. That's a little broad. You know what she's advocating, this woman? Are you aware? I can't believe she's involved as deeply as you think. It doesn't really matter what you believe. Well, what are your interests? business. All this negative publicity makes the factory owners nervous. China begins to look more attractive. It means I lose clients. What about you? I thought you could wait to the back of the factories. Better pay, better working conditions is always what I'm fighting for. But I don't want to see mass unemployment because the uh, factories are migrating to another cheap labor market. The situation only gets worse for the people who have uprooted their families, they've moved to Juarez, who's going to put the food on the table? Hmm? Can you help us? And what do you have in mind? A meeting. Do you want to meet? Not me. Him. She might listen to him. Listen to him say what? End all this. Look, I... We can help her. Not that gang in East L.A. What about her family? Huh? The church. We want her to come in from the cold and help us in Paris, and you and Patrick will be there to keep an eye on things. Well, what makes you think she'll listen to me? Well, she seems to have your ear. I can only assume you have hers. Sacramento wine still not doing it for you? Karina, I didn't, uh, didn't know you were there. 
This isn't her. What? She doesn't look like this anymore. This is the child's eye view. The FBI are looking for her and the police in Juarez. You know they have her down for murder. That's ridiculous. We have to think about where this is going, Father. Only God knows that. Oh. What do you want from me? We have a responsibility. To whom? To the innocent. Jew doesn't confide in me anymore. Father, please. I'll do what I can. Excuse me. Just as this movement was gaining momentum and support, the church has issued a statement rejecting any claim of a miracle by the so-called Virgin of Ores. She go to Rabbit's party? In fact, the subject, whose only known name is Mariella, is wanted in connection with killings in the border towns of El Paso and Juarez. You know, we're not to call you that. She is said to be associated with an East L.A. gang that is known for trafficking in drugs and illegal firearms. All right, I have two things to offer, gentlemen. Where she's going to be and when she's going to be there. Okay, where, when? With Patrick Nunzio. He's pledged his full cooperation. He'll do that. To wear a wire. <laughs> Deal. Why are you doing this? I thought that we had a plan. A plan? I have no plan. Yeah, well, whatever it is, I mean, it doesn't involve sit down talks with the enemy. Is Patrick Nuncio the enemy? It's capitulation, playing by their rules. Saying, let's talk, let's try to meet somewhere in the middle. It just doesn't work, it doesn't make sense. I don't trust them. What's going on, Gio? I, I just want to do it our way. Are you losing your faith? Nah, of course not. Hunger. Hunger Patron, super play. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I just thought you'd like to know that it's happening. The meeting between your little virgin and Patrick Nunzio. Now? Even as we speak. And I've got some good news for you. What would that be? I spoke to the bishop about your girl and discussed her beatification. Her what? That's right. She plays her cards right. Everything works out. She's prepared to put it on the fast track. Wait, what are you talking about? You can't be a saint until after you're dead. What are you saying? Nothing. Forget it. No. He said this when? I don't even remember. I, you know, I said forget it. All right, let's just, let's just go across our fingers and pray everything works out. I cross my fingers when I pray. Here you go again. That's great. Unit 4, what's your 20? Covering the rear, over. Two, we're in position on the ground. heartache for a lot of people. Uh, this I, I, I believe. <sighs> uh, sorry, I'm a little nervous. Uh, I know you from somewhere. No, 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 no. Radio contact. No sign of movement. Standing by. Where did you get that from? It's mine. Oh, yeah.
Give me my medal back. I'm not this person. Some, some, something came over. Um, somebody else, see? Okay. What are you telling me? I'm not a murderer. You're not? No. Be look, 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 look at you. Look. You're not dead. Dad? No! I'm in. One over here. I'm out. No, no es tu culpa. Es culpa del mundo. Todos nosotros.
Bueno. She's gone. The police tried to bring her in. There was a gunfight. Then it's over. No one even knew where she was. There's no way to identify the body, not with any real certainty anyway. We saw the gang members got away. Fan off into the city. You think perhaps she's alive? Esta vida. <laughs> what? Esta vida. I want you to know that I'm fighting on behalf of the world's struggle against violence and fear. And beyond that, towards peace and harmony. Porque el amor es el camino. Con el amor no nos debilitamos. Look inside. No hay más. Todo está en ti. We will be broadcasting again.